a friend of mine gave me this Kate Hill vanilla. It's the almond milk yogurt, artisanal almond milk yogurt. And I've seen it in the stores plenty of times, but I haven't tried it. So I'm gonna try it for you now and see what I think. And just to mention, it's soy and dairy free. Um, it's traditionally cultured. It's um, vegan, it's non-GMO almonds, which is important. No preservatives or artificial flavors and live cultures. And please don't mind my hair. It's, uh, I curled it last night. I had it in roll, slept in rollers, these little pink sponge rollers, and it kind of came out in a little while, but it's good to soften um, as time goes by, probably in the next half hour. So um, I can show you what it looks like um, after. So I'm just gonna stir it a little bit. So here's the yogurt. You can see, you can see inside. And I'm just gonna take a little bit. It's very, first it's very, um, it's not that thick. It's sort of um, just a very thin consistency. Mm. Mm. I wasn't expecting it to, sad to say I wasn't expecting it to taste that good, but um, hmm. I wouldn't necessarily say it tastes, it tastes like yogurt, but it doesn't taste like your traditional dairy yogurt. It's, it's interesting, but it til still tastes like yogurt. I don't know if that makes any sense. Um, it's very sweet, and you can definitely taste, if you're familiar with plant-based milk, almond milk, it tastes like almond milk. Um, and it's just, it's very sweet and pleasant. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's really delicious. I think it's maybe because of the cultures that it, it, it seems like you're tasting or eating yogurt but the taste is different from dairy yogurt, slightly. Um, it's not completely that like, alien-like. It's, it's, it's good. Um, I would definitely buy Kate Hill's almond milk yogurt again. This is the vanilla. And um, let me see, it has 11 grams of fat, 1.5 grams of saturated fat, uh, five milligrams of sodium, and 14 grams of sugar, and five grams of protein, so. Um, it's high, a little higher in sugar, but if that isn't something that you are necessarily too um, concerned about, then go for it, you know, and it does have protein, so you get protein as well. It's delicious. I'm going to eat it for breakfast. So my hair is pretty much ready. I'm about to leave to go out soon. Um, and, you know, sometimes I just like it curly. I, I, I like um, a little wave to my hair because after it dries, um, there just really isn't any shape to it or any type of uh, volume. So I like to put rollers in and sometimes I'll just put rollers in like a half an hour to an hour before I actually like need to go out or I'll sleep in them overnight. So this is after I've slept in them overnight. So it gets them a lot like more kinkier and curlier and the, the curl is tighter. But then the wave lasts like longer throughout the day. Um, so depending on your hair, um, you know, everyone's hair is different, so it's going to take to a curl, to a roller, to a, um, an ironing rod, a lot different. Um, so um, I can't say that the way my hair turns out, it's gonna be like that for everybody's hair. But um, I actually, I only did this half of it, I curled it, and then I left this down. Um, but it's okay, it's kind of, it's softening out and it'll soften out even more as the day goes on. But um, uh, yeah, this is this is pretty much how it looks. And it's just so stylized. And um, that's just with the rollers. I use like the pink sponge rollers. I have other types of rollers in here too, but I've had these rollers, this these actual rollers for two and a half years and um, they still lasted me two and a half years. And they're just like these cheap rollers from the drugstore. Um, they're probably, I mean, in terms of an, 
the way they were made. They're probably not environmentally um, made very well, but you could always find rollers that are eco-friendly or are made or uh, environmentally responsible. But um, the good thing about these is you don't have to use heat, so I didn't have to use any electric. And um, you know, they're very convenient to use and they work really well in my hair. And um, these are actually lasting me a long, long time. So um, I love it. It's a little messy, but 